ChatGPT is also excellent if you need to you know, create scripts or prepare yourself for maybe giving a presentation or a speech. ChatGPT can help you really outline that and think about that more without uh, and help you make sure that you get everything covered. So let's do that with an example here. So let's say your, your manager comes to you and there's an all company meeting and you need to give a speech on uh, the importance of your department to the company, right? Why your department's important to the company. And um, let's do that and see what ChatGPT comes back with, right? So, um, which just giving a speech can be nerve-wracking itself, but this can help actually write an entire script for you, example. So we might ask it to write a script, so please, you know, write a script for a presentation to the entire company. So more detail is good. Entire company about, and let's say you work in accounting, about the accounting department and its importance to the company, all right? All right, so congratulations, you're all, we're all accountants now, right? So I hope you enjoy that. All right, so think about how agonizing that might be to do and how to really start outlining and structuring that. Here it's coming right back, right? You might not know anything about accounting, but let's, they're, they're gonna you know, kind of give you an example here, right? So uh, I'm here today to talk to you about the accounting part and its importance to the company, okay? So what is accounting, right? Um, and now why is the accounting department important to our company? You know, this is nice too, where it gives a little briefing about accounting that's not gonna go on for 17,000 pages. That's what you'd want maybe in a short little speech to the company. Why is the accounting department important? And they'll talk about the different importance of the accounting department. You know, just our general things that are universal to accounting departments. Now maybe your accounting department doesn't do certain things. Maybe your accounting department doesn't have a role in budgeting and forecasting, well that'd be unusual, but let's say it didn't, that was more finance department or something. You know, you can just take that stuff out and then build on this as an outline and add in there, you know, with like who are the team members in the accounting department? Who's the person you would contact if you need help from the accounting department as far as a company-wide speech, right? Or something of that nature. So, but either way, I now have an entire script that I can start as a basis point and then cut and then edit the script and then add in more unique things like who is in the department, what's my role in the department, um, how does accounting work, what are the accounting department's hours, if that matters, uh, when we're busy, you know, uh, at the end of the months and end of quarters, and, and by the way, get your expense reports on time or accounting gets mad, you know, <laughs> you, know, I, you know, those kind of things you could have in there too. But you can see for scripting of any type of thing, you can just add in, um, you know, add, you know, add in there like a script for anything. Like, let's say you want to write a script for asking the the gov the city to add a stop sign in your neighborhood. I'm no way I'm going to spell neighborhood. Bur, bur. Why can't I spell neighborhood? Neighborhood for child safety. All right, so. Cars are going by your neighborhood real fast. You want you're going to give a presentation to the school board or maybe the city and say you know, the city and you want them to spend money uh, and do that. So here you have dear city council members or whatever you might be. It might be county commissioners. It might be whatever is local to you because you're going to adapt all this. You know, but just time but I'm requesting to write this and you put at this intersection. You have to put in the intersection and stuff. You know, I urge you to consider this. So. Here's just a short little thing that's uh, about, you know, giving a little script thing for uh, organizing your thoughts around just asking for a stop sign in your city neighborhood. So, um, you know, things that are beyond that too, this could be adapted into an email as well, for example. So there you have it. ChatGPT can really be helpful if you, you know, if you give a lot of presentations or if you don't give a lot of presentations, it can help organize your thoughts and then you build on that and customize it. You're not plagiarizing or copying and pasting because it wouldn't make any sense. You might not be in the accounting department, for example, but you can get an outline. In fact, you could just use this example I just used and put in your own department and boom, you just had a script for your own department right now.